bottom and top with the blue ball. We're going to start, we're going to work on the heel bone. So there's the heel bone, we're going to work just in front of the ball there. Then we're going to work up and down that mid part of the arch and across that front part of that foot. So find the ball, put a good amount of weight on it, keeping that knee bent. And all you're going to do is just kind of find it, rocking that heel back and forth. Find that good tight spot hanging out there. Work the heel for about 30 seconds to a minute. Then you're going to move the weight up and down that foot. When you find a really good spot where you're actually going to display and curl your toes, just to kind of keep that moving, work that ball to just behind those toes. You're going to work across that arch and at each toe, you're going to splay, curl those feet, move across, splay and curl those feet. From your toes, your feet, we're actually going to come up to our calves. So what you're going to do is you're going to do a high kneeling stance. So knees wide apart, feet in. So knees wide apart, feet in. What you're going to do is you're going to take that ball, put it on that outer part of that calf, one on each side. And you're just going to drop the weight, hip hinging back till you feel that massage in there. And then you're going to transfer the weight into one calf, gently rocking around. Same thing in the other one. Work that spot for about 30 seconds. Move the ball down a little bit. And you're gonna work that top part of that, that outer calf. All right, coming to your hamstrings, what you're gonna do, take a chair, sit down in that chair. You're gonna find that sort of distal part of the hamstring, that far end towards that knee. You're gonna put that ball just in there, sit up nice and tall, pull yourself down towards that chair, keeping that back nice and flat, straighten that knee out, and then relax, straighten that knee out. You're gonna straighten that knee out five or six times. Move that ball up an inch, same thing. Straighten that knee out five or six times. From there, we're gonna get into that hip area. So what you're gonna do, drop that one ball down on the ground. You're just gonna start sticking underneath that middle part of that butt cheek. And all you're gonna do is transfer all that weight onto that ball. And you're gonna do small little circles from the bottom of that butt cheek right around that top, working up towards the top of that hip bone, so working way up towards that top up there, working up there, gradually working around that side of that hip, moving on to the side of the hip, keep coming around, and you're gonna go right around that front. So again, those small little circles, all the way around to the front of that hip. Keep hanging out whenever you find those tight spots. Into the mid back. Take the two balls, stick them on the ground. We're gonna start roughly that mid-level, that back. So stick them on the ground, balls together, either side of the spine. If you do one ball, just put one side of the spine. Drop that body right down, tuck that chin. Give yourself a bear hug so it's nice and loose. And what you're gonna do is just move those ribs around, move those shoulders and arms around, five to six passes. From there, hands, palms up. Snow angels, five or six passes. And then arm scissors, five or six passes. And once you've done that, move down and you repeat all the way up that back. When you get up to the top of that back, so way up high, so you move the balls all the way up to there, Drop down, you're going to do the same pattern, but what you're going to do is you're actually going to bridge those hips right up, then give yourself a bear hug, work around, snow angels, arm scissors, with those balls really up high by that neck. From there, we're going to come up to those upper traps and pecs. So what you're going to do, take that ball, stick it way up top up there, you're going to come into a door frame, so your head's going through a door, Push in to that door frame in there. Let that arm swing. Reach in behind your back. From there, bring it up in front of that collarbone. So just top of that shoulder, same thing. Push into that door frame. Work that arm around. And that is bottom to top with the blue ball.